Okay, today I want to talk a little about Victus. A Victus is a container where you can store variables in it. So, um, like integers, you can store integers in the Victor. So, uh, just did start. We're starting to include the standard IO stream. Just like that. Okay? Then, a Victor have a library for itself so uh, we're going to include Victor and uh, then we are going to using namespace std and let's just start our main here so um, let's start off by making a Victor and uh, inside the two uh, weird things we can uh, set the type of the victim so if we are going to store integers in it we can type int oh, sorry and uh, then we will give it a name like integer whatever you can call it okay so now I'm going to make uh, int whatever you can call it whatever you like but I'm just calling whatever and then we're going to I'm oh, sorry uh, write something to the int whatever so we're going to do like that and then we want to store whatever in the integer so what we're going to do is we're going to type the name of the vector and then we're going to say something or write something that's called push back this will push back the integer oh sorry the whatever into the integer but uh, in the two parameters here, we're going to type the victor's name because, oh, sorry, we're going to type the int's name because that's what we're going to push back into the victor. So we're going to type whatever, and then it's pushed back into the victor. So uh, if you want to count a victor, see out something called I just called count, then you are going to like if we're going to take the start of the victor we have to do it like this so count and then the victor's name integer and in parameters we're going to take the first object or the first integer in the victim so we're going to type zero for the first integer and then just end line and because many dumb people is typing system mm, house mm, because they're typing this is because they are totally news. I'm just going to type send get because this is going to swallow the first scene here. So what you just entered here this one will in some reason or some kind deleting it or whatever you like to call it why don't you do it like this and then you're going to do the next and get this is going to tell that the um, that it's waiting for a key to be pressed and then we're just closing up the brackets so uh, let's see if we have set it up correctly zero hours you see and then just I press control 5 and um, now you have to type in a in an integer we are just typing 5656 six, just like that and then when we press enter it will count the integer or the victor actually so like that and there you see okay now, when you are going to make a bigger uh, program, you want a vector normally in a function. So, uh, <laughs> sorry, but uh, my friend is sitting behind me and uh, typing bigger dick and a big smiley. <laughs> but uh, okay, let's make a function here. So, we're going to delete this and make a void 
and then a vector with integers in and we call it integer and then in the parameters we're going to tell that we're going to make a vector integer and it's so you so you, you have to do a reference to to read from it so um, oh actually to yeah whatever uh just this it will require it's it will require this sorry and then then we're going to just say um, oh do you know what this is wrong we just call it integer sorry and then we're going to call this integer okay and then we open it and then we can make it int and call it just x whatever and then we're going to uh, type something into x so we're going to set x in x and now we want the x to be pushed into the integer so we're going to tell say integer that push back x now x is inside integer then we just want to count it out so we're going to say integer oh, integer 0 and line and that's pretty much it for this function now we're going to make another vector in the main so we call it integer refer I mean reference and then we are going to call the function to call a function we're doing like this type the function's name and the parameters we're going to take the vector in main call refer so we are typing in those things into this because it's referring to this vector here but um, just like that and uh, yeah then you can you could cut it out again we're just going to do that refer so just like that let's check if there's an error nope run it okay Okay, as you see, we call the function here. First, we're going. We made our vector here. Call the integer here. So then we are here. It made the int. Then we're going to count <coughs> something into x. So we just say x. When I press enter, it push back the x eight and count it out two times. So let's try eight eight. And uh, that's pretty much what I had to say about vectors today. And um, if you like the video, or if I could have done something better, then tell me. So, thanks for watching.